Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you how to fix the error this PC must support Secure Boot in Windows 11. First of all you have to make sure to check if Secure Boot is enabled without entering BIOS. To do this simply press the start button in the lower left corner and type MS Info. Then select system information from the search result. In the following window under system summary you will find an option called Secure Boot State. If it's on, it means that Secure Boot is enabled, and if it's off, Secure Boot is disabled. So this is most likely why you keep getting this error. So if you want to enable Secure Boot from BIOS, click on the Start button, then simply select the Settings icon. Afterwards, click on Update and Security. Then in the left tab, find and select the Recovery option, and in this category you have to search for the Advanced Startup section which has a Restart Now button. Simply click on it and then when you get to the Boot options, select Troubleshoot. Now click on Advanced Options and lastly select the UEFI Firmware Settings category. Your PC will reboot into BIOS or UEFI. This might vary from computer to computer, but usually you can find it on the Security tab which has a Secure Boot option. Now enable the secure boot by toggling the option to on and accept the changes if you're prompted. Usually it's F10 on your keyboard to save the changes and exit BIOS. And that was it. You should now be able to install Windows 11 with no issues whatsoever. You can also bypass the secure boot requirement. For this you need to have a Windows Insider account to download the Windows 11 ISO preview build. I have also posted a video on this channel on how to do this so make sure to check it out. After you downloaded the Windows 11 ISO simply right click it and select the mount option. Then go to the Windows 11 image then select all files, right click on them and then copy all files or use the Ctrl plus C shortcut. Now you have to create a new folder. Simply right click on an empty space then select new and then folder. I strongly suggest naming this folder Windows 11. And now all you have to do is copy the files straight into the Windows 11 folder. This will take some time so be patient. Afterwards mount the Windows 10 ISO just like you did for the Windows 11 ISO in this solution. Of course you need to make sure to get the Windows 10 ISO file as well from the Microsoft page. After mounting access the sources folder within the Windows 10 image and locate the appraisers.dll file, right click on it and select copy. Now go back to the Windows 11 folder you created earlier, open the sources folder and paste the appraisers.dll file after which you'll be asked to replace the file in the destination. Just go with it and overwrite the file. Lastly all you have to do is double click the setup.exe file from the Windows 11 folder to start the installation. This solution will enable you to bypass the secure boot check from the installation of Windows 11 so you won't need to make any changes to your BIOS. And that was it. Pretty cool, right? As usual, for more information and details you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.